So quick, quick fan bammer quiz right here. Ooh. The cash oh, is. Whoa. Delicious. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> suckers. <laughs> this is sugar free. <laughs> sugar. Oh. All right, hey you guys, welcome to another haul. Today it is Costco. So if you guys want to see us shopping for all of this stuff, make sure you go and check out yesterday's shop with me. It was a lot of fun because Ethan got to come with us. So he got to get dra it was more like dragging him along really because as it went on and on he realized like, oh man, this is taking forever. <laughs> so he got a kind of like glimpse into what it takes to do a grocery haul. But before we jump into it, I just want to say if you guys are new to our channel, please leave it out in the comments below that you are new. We would love to welcome you to the channel. And all those of you that have been here for a while, please welcome those newbies and also say hello. And make sure to go follow us on Instagram. We post a ton of stuff there. Um, we'd love to hear from you guys there also. Let us know if you're a newbie. Let us know if you're a silent viewer. Let us know if you're a silent viewer no more. <laughs> Let us know if you're, I'm so tired. You guys don't even understand. <laughs> you guys don't understand because he was literally napping not that long ago. He's been up since 2.30 in the morning. So oh, yeah. he's a crazy workaholic and he is gonna kill himself if he doesn't slow down. <laughs> yeah, so I'm trying to get into this. Oh, he's gonna try not to be monotone. <laughs> I already am. Oh, no, you're not. She needs to bust out the basmati. basmati. So we got a lot of fun stuff for you guys. I'm excited to show you. I've got some of the stuff we get, some of the stuff we're trying, um, a lot of organic stuff, some not organic stuff. So you guys know, you know our hauls. We get a little bit of everything. We have a balance as far as health-wise, snack-wise, Processed food processed wise. Processed food wise. So yes, we know we have some processed food. Yes, we know we have some healthy stuff. We have a good balance. And you guys know that when you watch our channel. So. We just got a ton of stuff for from Whole Foods for our recipes and things. So this stuff that I'm gonna show you guys is more of like our snacky, um, lunches, lunches, things to snack on when they get home. Um, so it's just kind of a variety of different things that will probably last us for quite a while. So let's get to it. Okay, first things first. We grabbed some of these. I don't think we've actually ever had these. I we? think we have. Have we? But like we've purchased like, them, I think individually. Okay, but yeah. never in the pack. So this comes with the uh, cinnamon apple, strawberry, and grape, and they're just like the fruit strips. So um, 36 fruit strips in here, 12 pouches of each flavor. So yeah, we're excited to try it. Great for the kids' lunches, after school snack. Boom, done. We also got the Seeds of Change. I can never say this. Is it quinoa? Quinoa? Quinoa. quinoa. I don't know. You guys know we're bad quinoa. at mispronouncing stuff. Quinoa and brown and rice. Can I just clear something up real quick? The cumin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I said it wrong in Whole Foods. I know how to say it. I don't know why I said it the wrong way. Anyways, I know how to say it, guys, I think. Today. <laughs> After Today. you've been corrected. Yeah, after I've been corrected. Now I know, so thank you. It's not coming. <laughs> but I knew that, like even when I said it, I hesitated, I was like, why did I just say that? And I was gonna correct myself, but then I was rushing through it. Anyways, cleared up, okay? All right, so this is, I don't know. I still don't know how to pronounce it. Q and Q? Quinoa. Quinoa. I say quinoa. 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 All quinoa. right, so, and it's brown rice with garlic, so. They also had one with a mix of kale and something else, but we wanted to try this one out. So we're gonna try this. You guys know we like rice, so we're gonna just try it and see how we like it. It is organic, and it comes with six. Six. Look pouches. on the look on the front side, right there. Boom. Boom. Six pouches. There you go. So easy, quick for those days we need easy, quick meals. Boom. Done. Speaking of easy quick meals, we love these Golden Grill hash brown potatoes. They are super, super easy and super, super delicious. The kids love them and we go through them like pretty quick. Yeah, so, all of the kids are like, oh, hash browns. we have hash browns? So we do the hash, brown, hash browns and then we'll put like eggs with it or really whatever. They just, they love, they eat these up. Wait, so. eggs? You're vegan though. I'm not vegan <laughs> we're just trying to be a little better i appreciated the comments 
that knew what we were talking about. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. But you know what? You guys seriously gave some awesome and amazing comments on our Whole Food or our Hall Food, our Whole Foods haul and our Whole Foods shopping thing. Like you guys know your stuff. It's seriously. really, really impressive. So I feel like, yeah, we're on this journey. We're learning little by little and it's exciting. So And on and honestly the vegan like recipes, like they literally are good. They're good. And like I said, we're gonna incorporate maybe like two a week. Try to do like two a week and slowly incorporate them into our life and just keep making them. So yeah, yeah we've done the grilled cheese, we've done the vegan nachos, which we will be doing a, a cook with me on those because they were amazing. The they only were pro so good. Yeah, the only problem is is uh, we ate all of the chips. Yeah. The so chips we were can't delicious. do a cook with me yet until we get some more. Yeah, so we will do be doing that with the jackfruit. So so good. So yes. good. Alright, you guys know that we love the graham crackers. Again, Braden puts them, scrunches them, eats them in his milk. Good, good little snack after school. This comes in, there's four boxes inside of this. So, delicious. I wonder, do we have milk milk? We don't have milk milk. So, would he have it with almond milk? I don't know. We're, we're going to try it. Yeah, we should see. Yeah, because we're not really, we're trying not to buy as much milk. You guys know we're trying to cut out some dairy. So, okay. I also picked these up. I saw these on the Costco's Instagram. They posted these and then I saw them in the front of the store. So I grabbed them. I just want to try them. They're the organic, gluten-free, non-GMO, whole grain, vegan, Mary's, gone, crackers, original crackers. So they look good to me. I might be the only one who eats these, to be honest. I don't think the kids will. Try one. Boom. Okay. Here we go. Rip her open. I'll no. let you guys know. Because it was telling, it was saying... That's how they come. Two packages of these. I have a feeling Kina might be the only one eating these. I that's what I said. Ashlyn might. So it's um brown rice, quinoa or whatever, however you say it, flax seeds, sesame seeds, and um that's it. Blend it into a satisfying cracker. Go. That's good. That's good? Mm-hmm. Does it need like flavoring, like cheese with it? It or? would taste like you would think a healthy cracker would taste like. Oh, okay. So you could dip this in hummus, that would be good too. Oh. But I will, these will be a good snack. Sorry, talking with my mouth full. I like them. I don't know if the kids will like those ones. We'll try. <laughs> we have never gotten these, but we grabbed them. They're super expensive, not gonna lie. Um, they're the Oregon Kids Protein Organic Nutritional Shake Chocolate. This is a good way for them just to hurry and get something in them and out the door. So we're gonna try it. I don't know if they'll like it. They usually get, what do we usually grab them? Um, we get the, uh, I think it's Boost. We've been getting the Boost, like it's a, it's a protein shake that's for, I guess, in a way like diabetics, which has low glu glucose, uh. glucosamine. Uh -huh. It's lower in sugar, basically. That's the only one. It's because so many of these kid protein drinks have like a ton of sugar. A ton. But, you know, it, they're still, it, I guess it's okay. They're going to burn it off throughout the day, but we're I'd rather. okay with a little bit of sugar yeah. too. Like that's, I mean. Oh yeah, we always, yeah, that. it's fine. Yeah. But, but I just try to find something with the lowest. Yeah, and this is great because it's gluten-free, soy-free, excellent source of calcium. So we're going to try it. It's got eight grams of protein, three grams of um, fiber. And it's got 18. There's 18 packs in here. Sorry, the dogs the are dogs chasing are each chasing other. Chasing each other and being crazy. I know some of you complain about it, but <laughs> that's just how it is. Yeah. Either Real they life. chase each other, or Benny goes Benny goes in his little uh, area and barks the whole time. Yeah. Or we put him They're in the going backyard. Outside now. <laughs> yeah, we put him in the backyard and he scratches against the door to get, for us to let him in. So it, there's it, always a noise. Yes. Real life. So. All right, so we grabbed this. I usually get the Vega protein um, powder. We're gonna try something new. We're getting the Organ Organic Protein Plant Based. Um, it's actually peanut butter flavor. Yeah. So I'm excited to try the peanut butter. Danny always puts peanut butter in his protein shakes anyways. And I always so, get the Garden of Life. I bet this is good with bananas. Yeah, I always get the Garden of Life vanilla chai. And so I wanted to try this one because I always put a little bit of cookie butter or peanut butter in my um, protein shake, but this one came peanut butter and it's plant based. So we wanted yeah. to we want to try it out. It's dairy free, gluten free, vegan, soy free, lactose free, non GMO. So 21 grams of protein, 
we love our protein shake mix. So hopefully this is good. I'm sure it'll be great. So we're gonna try that out. Yeah, and like we said, we're gonna try to be healthier in areas that like, honestly, where it's easier, we're probably gonna incorporate it right away. Yep. Where it's not as easy, it's not gonna be incorporated as, as easy. Yeah, well and protein shakes has been something we've really taken on. Like, yeah. We have our protein shakes every day after we work out and it's been Like awesome. we crave, like, we crave it the now. protein. Yeah, so this is real, well I don't know about this one. I'm sure it will be great. We'll let you guys know how we like that one. Okay, next up we got some organic um, blueberry, strawberry, raspberry, kale, and spinach frozen mix for our smoothies. Just a good way to get like your fruits and veggies in. So we haven't now ever tried this one. I'm excited to try it, see what it tastes like. I'm sure it will be delicious. Acai bowl. Acai, yeah, we could do that. And Acai. Kale is so good for you, but I do not love the taste of kale. It sounds gross. It's it's actually really disgusting. But if you can hide it in a smoothie, that's the way to go. Go for it. Yep. Go. All right. We also got these organic burger superfood. It's um, vegan, GMO free, and microwavable <laughs> so it's um we, i'm gonna i'm gonna try all these in the air fryer oh yeah these will be good in yeah the air fryer. Air fryer. and we had the beyond meat burgers, burgers yesterday i loved it yeah. to be honest and i posted it on the instagram yeah they were good they weren't my favorite like i have to get used to it and i think it's an acquired taste for sure but i it's good enough for me to like i feel like i will acquire a taste for it. And we ate them just with the um, the vegan cheese, the chow cheese, Which and no like. with no buns. So honestly, no buns, huh? No buns, baby. <laughs> baby. So, um, but honestly, like next time I'm gonna have it with the buns. I like my buns. I like my buns, huh? And I just I think it'll be so good. So these are interesting because they have um, that word again. Why? Kanoa. Kanoa. Thank you. That's what I think. Kanoa. I don't know. We're you guys are probably like face palming right now. You guys are idiots, right? <laughs> so it has quick what whatever and kale and almonds in it. Oh, so nice. I'm interested to try these. See how they are. They come at 12. There's 12 in here. So yeah. excited to try those. We got organic fruity snacks for the kids for their lunches. There's 72 pouches in here. So. I think that'll be, hopefully they like them. They're kind of picky with their fruit snacks. So, and then sugar wise, it has 11 grams, but. And going organic, like on these little snacks and stuff, you're talking to probably about a good two to three dollars more compared to regular. Yeah, it is more, unfortunately. Hopefully they like them, we'll see. We'll give them a whirl. We also got, you guys know, we always have to pick these up. Emberlin and Elijah absolutely love these. Chicken pot pie. Yeah, chicken pot pie. Still haven't got the chili ones. We will pick those up eventually. That Ethan loves the chili. Who wants a Walmart yeah, haul? who wants a Walmart haul? Okay, I just found out they do pickup service where you can buy it and go pick it up. I would be willing to do that. Yes. The only reason I don't go to Walmart is because of the crazy crowds. Yeah. So I would be willing to go pick it up and do a haul. We've done one Walmart haul and it one. was okay. Yeah. Let but... us know. If we get enough of you guys saying you want one, we will do it. Because they have they do have food there that we would And if like. you do go to Walmart, comment down below, just list it. I want a list of your healthy Walmart go-to items Ooh. like brands what are your healthy walmart go-to items aside from like the obvious like produce things yeah. like that what are your specific healthy walmart yeah do they have like a, a good organic um or vegan plant-based selection <laughs> yeah serious i don't know i don't go there enough yeah. to know, so. let us know because yeah, then i mean know. we'd like to balance it out we'd probably still go get some chips or some whatever of there course. Um, we'd get definitely get the chili pot pies. Yes, Ethan would be in heaven. But it would be nice to know if there's some good go-to healthy items at Walmart. That you guys love. Yeah. We got these mandarin oranges. She <laughs> said it. Mandarin oranges. I had to think about it too before I... What did you... I don't even know what you used to say. Um, We're going to have to rewind mandarin. it. Mandarin. Mandarin. Mandarin? No, that's no, mandarin. That's, right. that's okay. it. Well, you know, I've been converted. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys know Amberlynn loves these. Um, they're great for lunches, no added sugar, and it's just 20 cups in this 
package, so. Emberlyn literally like guzzles, she, like she drinks she, the juice, she loves those. She probably eats all of those, because I don't think any of the other kids do. Nah, but, she loves hey, them. they're great for lunches and things like that. It's a good after school snack too. Yep. Okay, so we got these instead of the um, normal fish we would normally get. Fish or even Cheez-Its. I was looking, there was, uh, there was like box of Cheez-Its right next to it. Oh yeah, so we're gonna try these. I don't know what they're gonna taste like, but they're the organic cheddar ducks. I don't know guys, we'll see if the kids like them, but they come like in packages, 45 bags in here, so. If not, we have we'll a very see. big donation to make of cheddar yes, ducks. we will donate to the needy if the kids do not want these or like these, so we'll see, hopefully they do. Okay, we got, you guys, I, the samples got us on this last time, and so we will probably buy this every time we go now, and Danny's like, grab two bags, so I was like, okay, so. Delicious. This so rice, good. it's the um, rice ancient and rice and ancient grains. How easy is it to make? Oh, it's just like regular rice. So okay. like if you were to make regular rice, that's how it is. So I do it with chicken booyah though. I know chicken what? Booyah. Chicken that's booyah. What we call it, but chicken bouillon. Yes. Is what it's really called, but chicken booyah. So I cook it with that. It gives it so much flavor, and it is delicious. You can make stir fry with this. You can do. Just use it, have it as a side. It's so good. So quick, good. quick fan bammer quiz right here. Ooh. This is a tester. Uh oh. When did when did we come up with the hashtag chicken booyah? Ooh, Ooh that's a good one. That is. I'm when curious. I'm gonna have to research myself. I'm gonna have to research myself. It had to have been. It's obviously in a hall. It's obviously in a hall, but which one? Did we first come up with okay, we'll chicken booyah? Up. We'll see who knows. Maybe you guys know before we do. I don't know. Yeah. That would be awesome. All right, Danny grabbed these. I'm not really sure. They're the Simply Clusters. I want to try one right now. Oh. Let's do this. Boom. So they're fruit seeds and nut clusters. Um, good source of fiber, no added wheat. It's organic. Okay, Danny. You know, for all of us, we have this kind of like a like. have kind of like a sweet tooth, and I'm just looking for something that's Sometimes healthier. Sometimes you just want to stick something in your mouth. You know what I mean? Like your uh, car. Okay. You know what I'm saying, though. Yeah, sure. Like if I'm sit, I'm in the car a lot, <laughs> so I'm sitting in the car. I just want to snack on something. Nice. Yeah. Actually, these are good. Whoa. Yep. Nope, these are amazing. These are really good. I am impressed. Actually. And I think the serving size there, so whatever the ingredients are, in the, or the... Three pieces. It's three pieces, yeah. So, you know what? I could just pick up three pieces of this real easily. So, no added wheat, no trans fat, no cholesterol, no artificial flavors, no preservatives, and... I'm trying, it's fruit seeds and nut cluster. You guys, these are really These are really good. good. Really, really, really good. Really good, like no lie. And they're not like hard, like you, they look hard uh -huh. like granola, but they're actually chewy. Wow, these are good. I'm totally down with these. If you've had these, let us know. If you haven't, go pick some up. These are good. Really, really good. I'm impressed. Still chewing on it. Mm. Those Simply Clusters are delicious. They're not gonna last, I'm hiding them in our secret yeah. cupboard. Well, I would like the kids to try it because if they, I'd rather True. them snack on those. They would those. love those. Okay, real quick. We got a big bag of chicken. Cause we're not vegan, but we, cause we really, lo we do love our chicken. Yeah. So we got this big, I love their big bags cause like, I don't know, all the chicken separated really good and all the fat is kind of cut off. So I love Costco's frozen chicken, really good. And yes, I was just thinking, who's tried Tina's <gasps> Olive Garden chicken? It's bomb, guys. Yes. Bomb bay. We have a cook with me of it, right? Yep, we have a cook with me with the Olive Garden chicken that I make. It is so, so good and so, so easy. And so. I would really love for Tina to get one of her friend's recipes on the Olive Garden pasta. The Olive Garden dressing pasta, that was delicious. Olive Garden, oh, that we had the other night. Yes. I'll get that and then we can do a... A cook with, cook me. with me. That would be so good. <laughs> that would, okay, I'll do that. Oh, so, yeah. yeah, I love it because it comes in two packs, Olive Garden dressing, I could drink it. Oh, it's yeah, so you good. almost bit that off. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you just Break. want something in your mouth. <laughs> Up. <laughs> All right, and then I grabbed their organic almonds. You guys are awesome because you guys let us know that Costco's like nuts are way cheaper than like Whole Foods and they come in bigger packages. So, bigger nuts, bigger packages. 
<laughs> You're crazy. That's a man's mind, right? Right to it. Right I didn't even it. say it. Yeah, you didn't have. Yes, you did say it. No, I'm just what? repeating what you said. No, but you are repeating it in a different way. <laughs> oh no. What yeah. are you thinking? <laughs> You I was know. thinking of like the bins no. over at Whole Foods. You know what you were saying. No, I was thinking of the bins no, at Whole Foods. Wait, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? The bins at Whole uh, Foods. Anyways. How you get a lot, like a large amount of. <laughs> You're such a man. Of the, the oh, cashews. Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh <know>. my gosh. <laughs> I don't even know. I'm still confused. No, what are you talking not. about? You're a good actor. Okay, <laughs> so anyways, I got the organic almonds from there because we will be making a vegan fettuccine alfredo coming up. Yes. And I need these for it. So grab some of these and I like to snack on these. I think I'm the only one that likes to snack on these, but they're delicious and I, they're good for you. I would be interested to see how the kids enjoy or what their thoughts of are with the um, the vegan Alfredo sauce. I'm super Compared curious. to Tina's just regular Alfredo Which sauce. Which I just made my regular the other day. Oh yeah, that was good. So good. The kids love it. That's so why I, I'm a I'm little curious, like, yeah. I don't know how they're gonna like it. We'll see, cause they love like my regular, but my regular has a lot of like dairy stuff and it. it has butter, it has um, cream cheese, and it has heavy whipping cream. So I say you make so, it without even telling them it's different. I'm going to. Yeah, that'd and be we'll sweet. we'll just see, we'll just see. So. That video will be coming up. Yes, too. let us know so, you guys want to see that. Yes. Then I also got the grilled chicken breast strips. You guys know Brayden loves these in his sandwiches for school. And honestly, anything to get that kid to eat because sometimes he'll just try to go to, to school without a lunch, even. I'm like, what are you doing? Serious. You're crazy. So I try to get things that he likes so that he will actually pack a lunch and eat it. Um, so, yes, I got that. Um, which is, is nice, like it's big. It's got two packs here um, of 32 ounces, so two pounds. Could you pounds. take some of that and just like Put it marinate it, soak soak it with the Olive Garden chicken? Oh yeah. The uh, Olive Garden dressing mm -hmm. and just like soak it for him and then you could make a sandwich out of it. Oh, he would probably like that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm sure I could get creative with this to where he will eat more. Cause I get it. like. Sandwiches get boring after a while, right? When you're packing sandwiches for your kids, it's like, so, like my kids are picky, so they like salami or peanut butter and jelly, so I make that all the time, and then they slowly come home and there's more and more of the sandwich. Yeah, there. and the thing is, is they like them plain. So it's- They like them plain, so I can't, like it's hard to like- Yeah, you can't add like a little- It's hard to, yeah, because for me, I'm like, I'll add Whatever. The only one I good. think might be okay with something would be Ethan. If you like snuck in a little sriracha sauce, he might be like, hmm, like that was tasty good. good. I like, might try that with him. Yeah. Because, yeah. It's the only one. Everyone yeah. else is like seriously nothing no, on it. Oh, so I have to like try to get creative without being able to be creative. So, so comment below if you have any kids that you have to be creative with as far as like adding flavor or adding variation to their lunches so it doesn't get boring. Yeah, because it does. And we'll do coming up also uh, like a what's in my lunchbox thing with the kids. So anyways, yes, Brayden loves this for his sandwiches for a little while. <laughs> okay, and I also got this big pack of string cheese. Kids love this in their lunches. They love them for after school snacks. Just really good, and it comes with 60. There's 60 string cheeses in here. Is so. there like a vegan string cheese? I don't know, I would be huh. curious. Let us know, you guys, if there's like an alternative, like um, non-dairy string cheese. It's gotta taste good, because string cheese is string cheese. Yeah, it has to taste good. So that's why I still grab this. I don't wanna deprive my kids of everything they love. So they love this, I still got it, um, and it's great for their, their lunches and whatever. So I just throw them in and boom, done. Delicious. Okay, so we picked up this two pack of the Honey Nut Cheerios. Pretty much, we try to get cereals that all of the kids will eat. This is one that all of them will pretty much eat. So yeah. we got this. With you, or without honestly, milk. For breakfast, they usually like me to make eggs. Like I've been making eggs for them every morning. Yep. So that's usually what they have. They'll have eggs or what else? And they had eggs today with the um, sugar free syrup. Yes, and it. It was a hit. Yeah, they loved it. Yeah, they couldn't tell the difference. I didn't even tell them. And then I asked them, I'm like, how's the syrup, guys? They're like, fine, why? I was like, because it's sugar free. <laughs> <laughs> so I was excited about that. Tricked ya. Yeah, ha ha, suckers. Okay, next up we've got two packs of bananas. Because we love these for our smoothies. I will take one of these and leave them out, and I will take the other one, chop it up, and freeze them. So we love them for smoothies. Elijah is especially a banana lover, so 
These are delish. We I got like our bananas. I like them to top my acai bowls. Slice yes, them. Yes, mm -hmm. good with a little bit of honey. Ooh, yum. Okay, and then we got some avocados because I like to make my guacamole. If you haven't seen that cook with me, go check it out. Oh. It's super easy guacamole, and it's delicious and healthy and yum. Yes. So I picked up some of that so I can make some of that. And then we also got, Danny likes these chicken skewers, so handmade with chicken breasts. Not and just me, the kids love them with basmati rice and oh hummus. Yeah, with hummus and basmati rice, so yeah. good. So all vegetarian fed, no added growth hormones, gluten and preservative free, made with olive oil, fully cooked. So you really just have to stick them, like you could stick these in the oven and or on the grill, whatever. But they come with, I don't know how many. Oh. Okay, so there's about 14 in here. Perfect for like an easy go-to dinner night. Because we have soccer and sometimes we just need quick dinners. Okay, also Dan is favorite croissants. I love them. Croissants. And if you if you didn't see already in the in the shop with me, I mentioned how there's a sell-by date that they have on there and they circle them. And so this one says the 24th which means the further out the sell by day, day is means the more the fresher they are when you buy them. Yeah. So like there was some that were like 823, 822, this one was 824. Yeah. So I, I got those. So they were fresh. Fresher. And he's eating one right now, mm -hmm. just FYI. So he loves these. I don't really eat these much, but I'm trying to cut out a lot of bread too. Yeah, so. that's my weakness, but. They're good though, you deserve it. I love you the croissants. Hard. Okay, so another thing, Danny grabbed these. Um, it's a big old bag of nacho cheese Doritos. I plan on doing a little something with them for a cook with me. That's it. Don't tell anymore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Boom. A little something, something. So, yes, we still buy Doritos, but I'm gonna follow this up with a lot of greens after this. So, dude, yes. just kind of forget about these. This is gonna be in kind of a semi-cook with me that I'm planning on doing soon. There's so many cook with me's we have planned. Yes, there's so much stuff. But so. we don't want to like just oversaturate the channel with a bunch of just cook with me's in a row. Yeah. So, so, we're trying to keep up with the variety. That's right, that's right. With a variety show. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Do that again. No. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I'm glad I edit because I'm replaying it. Uh, no, you're not. Yes, I am. Oh. The variety show. Oh, man. Okay, so here we go. We got the organic spring mix. I love these quick, easy salads. We also got the baby spinach. Ethan was like, Mom, get the spinach because he loves spinach with ranch. He loves it. Yes. So, we got that and good for smoothies. So we got those two things and then while we're on the lettuce, I will get, we got these, the Pete's Living Greens, that's the butter lettuce. Super, super good for lettuce wraps or whatever. Like that's what I'm using them for is lettuce wraps. So Would that work if you got like the jackfruit, the Tex-Mex yes. jackfruit, put yes. it in there? That with... would actually probably be delicious. Wow. So we could try it with the jackfruit. You could try it, you know, a variety of different ways with whatever you like. So you could make it vegan, you could make it non-vegan. So good. But I got this idea from Cheesecake Factory because this is what they use for their Mexican wraps. Mm. Best thing in the world. Tina so loves them from the Skinny Licious yes, menu. Skinny Licious. Go check out our Eat With Me at Cheesecake Factory. Yes, I get those and they are so good. Oh, whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Seriously, guys, I'm kind of scared over here. I'm uh, probably embarrassing you. I don't know. I am what I am, guys. I am what I am. Okay, carrots. Great for lunches, great for snacks. I use these little Tupperware bowls to put ranch in if the kids, like Ethan likes them with ranch. That's the only way he'll eat them. Amberlynn will eat them plain. So for the ones that like them with ranch, I'll stick them in this little thing and they'll take them to school. So, carrozzo. Mm. They're good for your eyes. No. Has a blind rabbit ever seen me? That's the question. Oh. <laughs> probably not. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think there's blind rabbits. And he probably doesn't eat carrots. No. Nope. <laughs> okay, we also got celery. And I love it that it's already like chopped up and you know done because I need to save time. I have time for nothing anymore, I feel like. So, celery sticks. Amberlynn loves, loves, loves these with peanut butter. These are also delicious with cream cheese. So, um, vegan wise, I wonder how they would be with Honest? like with cookie butter. I don't know. That sounds gross though. Why? <laughs> I don't know. I like the cum well, I, the, I like the tastes okay. It might I like okay. the the crunchy cookie butter. It's good. Yeah, it might be good. You could try it. I like it with cream cheese if 
vegan. If you guys have a cream cheese alternative, let me know. Oh, the chocolate yeah. cheese might be good in here. The Miyoko's. Oh, the Miyoko's. Yeah, they probably have spread. I'm gonna try it with they the spread. Try the one that's the, oh, with that's the, herb, the herbs and spices one. Doing it. Yeah. I'll let you guys know how that is too. Okay, also got cucumbers. Also, another great snack. Kids love it. I love it. We all love it. The Driscoll's. Look you at those. You want to talk about Driscoll's, how they emailed us and yeah. wanted shirts and stuff? <laughs> Driscoll saw our, um, our taste, taste test, test and was they emailed us, I think yesterday or the day before. Yeah. And they're like, we love Driscoll's. What's taste up? Test. They're like, you know, our crew saw the taste test and we'd like to send you guys some swag. That's literally their words. Swag and coupons. And coupons. And okay. so we're going to have a bunch of coupons, not only for us, but we're going to try to have coupons for you guys yeah. as well. We always try to like in any type of like sponsorship or deal, like we need to do a giveaway for our viewers because you guys are awesome and amazing and we wouldn't be here without you guys. So we always try to give back a little bit. And, so. and I'm going to seriously say every single week I get some type of message or picture from our viewers about Driscoll's. About Driscoll's. Yes. Danny, exactly. look at the Driscoll's. Danny, this is this. I literally get emailed pictures, Facebook pictures, Instagram pictures of like, of like Driscoll's. The and, dog is distracting me. Wow. And today, someone tagged us on Driscoll's page saying, Phillips Fam Bam turned us on to Driscoll's and we I love know. them. So we're That's like, so this is so awesome. awesome. Yeah, you guys are awesome. So we'll show you guys our swag when we get it from Driscoll's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. It's probably so. a big old strawberry costume. <laughs> For Halloween. We should be strawberries for Halloween. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Our kids would hate us. <laughs> hey, did you guys check out what I was last year for Halloween? What were you? I was the old man skateboarder. <laughs> oh, that's right. I was the old woman. Yeah. With the mask. We were rocking. You guys it. gotta check that out. We I'll link rocking. I'll link that right up above. Yeah, that was fun. Alright, moving on. We are gonna try these. We've never had them. The veggie bites, gluten-free blend, um, GMO free, gluten-free, vegetarian, microwavable. Boom. Just quick after school snack, delicious. And it's got four grams of protein, so why not? Yeah. They look good, so. I um, think like cause there's times we make little meatballs like for quick little bites after school. Yeah. And I was like, oh maybe we could try that and In see the if air that. Fryer. I yeah. bet they're good. Both show. Okay, salami for the kids' lunches. They love the hard salami, so grabbed a bunch of that. The, the dogs, dogs are crazy. going after look, look. Woo! Woo! Benny, Jasper, what are you guys doing? You're on camera, we can see you. They're fighting over a like chew toy. That's what you hear, guys, so. There you go. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry! Okay, crystal light. Ooh, wow. Crystal light. Got it, just to flavor our water. Sometimes I get sick of drinking just water because I'm like not drinking soda or anything like that anymore. I like to flavor my water a little bit sometimes. So, Crystal Light, we love it. Um, green grapes, you guys know we love to freeze the grapes. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> so, oh, wow. we got four pounds to freeze. So, we're gonna do that. Jeez, okay. <laughs> Frozen grapes are the bomb diggate. Yes. So, yes. All right, we also picked up some watermelon. I got two of these puppies. Hollow. Hollow. Nice. Hollow. It's me. You're <laughs> Instead of hello. Looking for. Is that how it goes? <laughs> is it me you're looking for? No. That's the That's wrong That's a song. different song. <laughs> <laughs> you're messing me up. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, so we got two watermelons. I need one for my activity tonight. So I wanted to get one for that and one for us. So there you go. All right, so here we go. We picked this up. These, the samples got us. Ethan tasted it and said what? We got to get them. Yeah. Yeah. Were, were they good? Like, what did they so taste like? Good. There's chocolate covered bananas. But yeah. it's dark chocolate. It's you dark, still like it? I still like it. He still liked it. Wow. I, I actually think Elijah and Emberlin will like these too. So really? they are the dark chocolate covered real banana slices and they are delicious. There's 20 packs in here. So. Pretty good, we'll try it. I don't know, I probably won't eat too many of these because I'm not a fan of dark chocolate, but if the kids want a little snack. I'm interested not? because Ethan's not a fan of dark chocolate uh -huh. either. Yeah, but he, he liked these. You were gobbling it up, so. How's your nose feeling, bud? Annoying. It's annoying him? It's annoying, yeah. allergies are so You annoying. should just go take a nap or take a nice good uh, steamed shower. That will feel real good on your nose. Yes. Okay, 
samples got us on this Whoa. whole bag too. This is so Whoa. big. So yeah, really good, really light. I like it. 33 calories a cup. It's um, pure coconut oil. So it's good, guys. This is yummy. I like it. And then Pirate's Booty, of course. You guys know the kids love this for their snacks, lunches. Yum, yum. Look at that. Nearly naked Pirate's Booty. Nearly. I What's know. up? What's up? With What's that up? Guy? Grandma Sycamore would not be impressed with that no. stuff. <laughs> that was funny. You're laughing at yourself a I lot am. today. I always laugh at myself because no one else laughs at me. I do. <laughs> I know. All right, so we got four loaves of the Grandma Sycamore bread. We still have some Dave's seeded bread that we still have, so I'll freeze two of these, use two of them. We go through bread like crazy during Yeah, the I was so. looking for the Dave's white bread because actually Emberlyn loves it, I love it, and they didn't have any at Costco, so. No. Hey, we also got the Hawaiian rolls. You guys know we love the King's Hawaiian rolls. Delicious, we get them every time we're there. They're so good. Um, they're not gluten-free though, so sorry. Um, sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Kids needed socks. I hate socks. I can't find them. They're like always missing. So we got Emberlyn some socks. We got the boys some socks. I think they were like nine bucks each. Nine, so nine bucks for tw 12 nine pairs. Nine bucks for 12 pairs of each. So pretty dang good. What else? We got the organic Kirkland brand um, tortilla chips. We're going to try these out. Haven't had these yet, but uh, don't let it yeah. fool you. It starts right there. And I'm... Nothing compares, for me, nothing compares to the Trader Joe's tortilla chips. Yeah, Trader Joe's. Nothing chips. compares yeah. to those. Those whole food chips were pretty dang good, though. Mm, yeah, but nothing compares to those Trader Joe's. Yeah, I, I could, Trader like, Joe's has the yeah, bomb. they're so good. Yeah, they're delish. Okay, and then I also got, we got a case of water, and we got a case of paper towels that comes with 12 rolls, and we've got some fabric softener over there and some food over here and over we there. totally here. forgot and we totally forgot the hail mary's oh lemon tarts or whatever what are they i'm so sad yeah they are the hail mary and we didn't realize they had them there and danny looked it up online and costco does carry them so i'm sad we didn't grab them they're the hail mary like lemon tarts that we that's in our um, whole, whole foods hall that did not last long. Oh. Like, we mouthed those. They were so good. So next time we'll have to grab those or we'll have to order some or something. I don't know. Okay, that is it for our Costco haul. We hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget, we do not only do hauls, we do vlogs, we do cook with me's, we do eat with me's, we do challenges, we do all sorts of things on our channel. So Go check out our channel. If you like it, hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button on this video. And stay tuned. We have a ton of fun stuff coming up. Awesome cook with me's. Another haul will be coming up probably next week sometime. We need to go to Trader Joe's. All right, you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for all of your support. You guys are amazing. You guys are awesome. We really appreciate it. And we will see you guys tomorrow. I've been dreaming about you Every night I see your clearest day It's just something about the way you make me feel Cause I can't